Here we go. Spin! <laughs> Stardew Valley! Okay! <laughs> Interesting. So that's a farming simulator game. Oh, yeah, that'll be fun. I'll play that for, like, maybe a half hour. Here we are. I guess we're gonna start a new game. Oh! I get to enter my name and everything. My name will be... Mark Du Dubois. Oh, we're gonna have the Dubois farm. <laughs> Obviously. <laughs> Thanks for joining in, Blame. I appreciate it. And have a fantastic rest of your night. What's my favorite thing? Frogs. <laughs> Animal province. We can have a cat, a cat, a cat, or a dog. Oh, there's a bunch of different... Uh, Marky seems like he would have a dog. Like, that, that kind of dog seems like he'd be, it'd be good for Marky. Marky with an afro? I don't think so. Isn't there, like, a bowl cut? That looks kind of like Marky. Wow, that's a lot of hairstyles. Wow, that is a lot of hairstyles. I don't even I don't can't even tell the difference between a lot of these. Good lord. Okay, now we're back to the beginning. I like 16. Oh. It's like the Luigi suspenders. Do we got, like, blue suspenders? Oh. Yeah, that that's good for Marky. <laughs> no accessories. That's fine. All of that is... All of that's fine. Ooh! Standard farm? Simple plot of land with a large amount of open space to design your farm. Riverland farm. Your farm is spread across several islands and scenic riverbanks. Fixtures are more common here than usual. No thanks. Forest farm. The woods limit your farming space. However, the bounty of the forest is nearly at your doorstep. Hilltop farm. Rocky terrain and a winding river make it difficult to design your farm. However, a mineral deposit provides mining opportunities. Wilderness farm. There's plenty of good land here, but beware at night the monsters come out. <laughs> Uh, there's Four Corners Farm. The land is divided into four parcels, each with its own perk. Perfect for a group. I'm on alone. own. And then the Beach Farm. Let's just do the standard good old farm. Yeehaw! Can't wait to see. Yeah, so I've, I've seen this opening before. <laughs> and for my very special grandson... I want you to have this sealed envelope. Oh, that reminds me. I actually should update... the game that I am playing on Twitch. Because I am playing Stardew... There we go. Sorry about that. Now we can go back to the game. I want you to have the sealed envelope, grandson. No, no. Don't open it yet. Have patience. Then... Okay. Now listen close. There will come a day when you feel crushed by the burden of modern life. Oh, that didn't even fit in the text box. It, there was so much to say. Oh, dear. What will I do? And your bright spirit will fade before a growing emptiness. He knows about the nine to five jobs. <sighs> when that happens, my boy, you'll be ready for this gift. Now let Grandpa rest. An unknown amount of years later. Yeah, so Grandpa died, he left us his farm. Uh, Joja, join us and thrive. We're at work, not rest. Smile, you're with Joja. Uh-oh, someone got terminated. <laughs> Yeehaw! Can't wait to keep doing Life's better with Joja. Okay, I believe you. Hey, look, it's Marky. Oh, God, I can't work here no more. 
I want to be on the farm like my granddad was. Dear Marky, if you're reading this, you must be in dire need of a change. The same thing happened to me long ago. I'd lost sight of what mattered most in life, real connections with other people and nature. So I dropped everything and moved to the place I truly belong. Cool. I've enclosed the deed to that place, my pride and joy, Du Bois Farm. It's located in Stardew Valley on the southern coast. It's the perfect place to start your new life. This was my most precious gift of all, and now it's yours. I know you'll honor the family name, my boy. Good luck. Love, Grandpa. P.S. If Lewis is still alive, say hi to the old guy for me, will ya? So, fun fact, I'm more familiar with the Star Bo Stardew Valley board game than I am with the Stardew Valley video game. I love the board game. It's so good. The graphics are nice! I like the mountainscape in the background. The wheels on the bus go up and down, up and down. Stardew Valley, half a mile. Oh boy, it's Robin! <laughs> Hello, you must be Marky. Uh. Progress is. Um, all I did was push the A button on my controller. That's literally all I did. Really? Wow, we apparently really did not like Robin. Introductions. It would be a nice gesture to introduce yourself around town. Some people might be anxious to meet the new farmer. Two out of 28 people greeted. I didn't greet anybody, actually. I'm a So apparently A, even though that's the A button, is the skip button. Oh, it's a decorative bowl. I can sit in here. We get parsnip seeds! Hooray! You received 15 parsnip seeds. Here's a little something to get you started, Mayor Lewis. Well, that was very nice. Light the fire, and then leave. Welcome to the, uh, weather report. Welcome to Kozu 5, your number one source for weather news and entertainment. And now the weather forecast for tomorrow. It's gonna be clear and sunny all day. That's what I'd like to see. I don't know any of the controls on the Xbox controller. So I, uh, I sure hope I don't mess up. I probably will. Use tool with X and the menu is paused. Cool. We all know the most important thing to do is go foraging, though. Okay, no. Put that back. Bus stop, darn it. I feel bad for completely skipping Robin's dialogue. I was gonna chat her up. Seemed like a nice girl. I wonder if this is one of those farming simulator games where time just doesn't pass if you're indoors. That would be pretty nice. It's the hospital. It's locked. Open 9 a.m. Yeah, most things open at 9 a.m. Uh, it's the first day of spring! Well, how nice. Uh, is there a way to, like, view a map, maybe? If you want to become a farmer, you have to start the basics. Use your hoe to till the soil, then use a seed packet on the tilled soil to sow a crop. Water every day until the crop is ready for harvest. Yeah, yeah, I, I'll do that eventually. But right now, people are more interested in me going around and talking to people. Joja Cola! Oh, that's good. We have a Joja Mart here. Feels just like home. Hmm, this is good music. I don't remember the music from Stardew, but this is very nice. Is there a way to, like, pull up a map? Oh. Yes, here we are. Where's the woods? The woods are over there. Oh, we're definitely far away. We're literally in, like, exactly the wrong place to be if we're trying to forge stuff in the woods. Well, maybe we can forge stuff in the mountains as well. Remember, folks, I really haven't played this game very much at all. I also took the forest farm in my first attempt at this. It's locked. It's open. Oh, hey, it's about to open.
Hey, is that you, Robin? Yep. Have you met everyone in town yet? That sounds exhausting. No, I haven't, Robin. And also, why did it skip all your dialogue last time? Oh, shoot! Time does pass while you're indoors! This is the worst! It's a farming game! Time is supposed to freeze if you're not in the great outdoors. Everybody knows that. That's how it was in Harvest Moon 64, and in Back to Nature, and in Friends of Mineral Town, and in more Friends of Mineral Town, and in the Friends of Mineral Town remake. It's Chef Pierre! <laughs> It's Marnie. Ah, uh, Mayor Lewis told you, me you were right, just arrived. I'm Marnie. Hey, girl. I sell livestock and animal core products at my ranch. You should swing by sometime. It's Gus. Hello there. I'm Gus, chef and owner of the Star Drop Saloon. I'm getting some supplies for the saloon. Pierre's got the good stuff. I don't even own Chrono Trigger. Uh, it's Pierre. Hey, it's Mr. Markey, the new farmer. I'm Pierre, owner of the local general store. If you're looking for seeds, my shop is the place to go. I'll also buy produce from you for a good price. Sweet. All right. Ooh. Bean starter, plant beans in the spring. It takes 10 days to mature, but keeps producing after that. Grows on a trellis. I don't have one of those. Plant these in the spring. It takes 12 days to produce a large cauliflower. Ew, but cauliflower sucks. Ah, uh, potatoes take six days to mature. What's something that I could grow in, like, one day? Parsnips. And even the parsnips ain't gonna grow in time. Who are you? Can I not even talk to you? It's Harvey. It's a pleasure to meet you. I'm Harvey, the local doctor. Hey, at least you have a name, unlike the doctor from Friends of Mineral Town. Boo, 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 boo. I'm pretty sure the saloon is not open at 10.30. Yeah, it opens at noon. That makes sense. yoo -hoo, anybody home? Guess not. Nobody locks their doors in Pelican Town. <laughs> it opens at high noon, exactly. Oh, hey, it's a beach! Who's here at the beach? It's locked. Only Elliot's friends can enter uninvited. You know, that makes sense. If it's Elliot's house, Elliot has a selective lock. It it only opens for specific people. Fish. Gone fishing. I'll be back tomorrow. But I want to meet you today. Yeah, look at all the trash on the beach. Is this Rita Rabbit Kindergarten or what? Maybe there will be some people in the saloon when it opens. Ooh, let's go into the sewer. We'll definitely meet some people in there. It's locked. Darn it! Yoo-hoo! Howdy, folks! I'm Marky, the new guy at the farm. Where is everybody? Why do people leave their homes unlocked, but then they're not- Oh wait, there is a person here. Hi lady, it's Emily. Ooh, I can read it on your face. You're going to love it here in Pelican Town. If you're ever looking for something to do in the evening, stop by the saloon. That's where I work. Okay. Uh, can I talk to you again? I don't want to sit in your couch, actually. I can't talk to her. You're not a good enough friends with Haley to enter her bedroom. Yeah, that makes sense. I literally can't talk to her anymore. She's like, why won't this creepy guy leave? Ooh, is this where a sailor lives? Hey, dude. It's Vincent. Ooh, a stranger! My name's Vincent. Mama says not to talk to strangers, but you seem okay. Darn tootin'! It's Jody. Oh, you aren't exactly how I imagined, but that's okay. I'm Jody. How did you imagine me, ma'am? Mark du boy. Everybody knows what he looks like. Okay, that's enough person's bedroom. So I'm pretty sure Emily is the only bachelor I've met up to this point. I don't care about doing the farm work. I, I more just want to meet people and get the layout for the town. 
Is this a church or is this... Wait, is this somebody's home? Oh, wait, this is the home I went into earlier. Oh, this is Lewis's house! Oh, well, Lewis is presumably at the town hall. That's why he's not at his home. He's the mayor, after all. Oh, old lady. Welcome! I want to get a Joja Cola. Marcus Thirsty! Buy a Joja Cola for 75 gold? Oh, yeah! Joja Cola. That probably will heal me. Oh, I could get beer. No, I... Oh, I could get beer, but that's like all my money. It's probably not the best investment to do. Hey, does anybody live in the saloon? I'm just kicking open all the doors. You're not good enough friends of Gus to enter his bedroom. Alright, where are the other people living? There are way more... Ooh, yes, this looks like a fancy place. It's Penny! Oh, hello, I'm Penny. Can you only talk to people once per day? Sure is feeling like that. Old guy in a wheelchair. It's George. <laughs> it's irritating to have to meet all these new people, huh? Name's George, by the way. Now buzz off. Yes, sir. You're not good enough friends of Alex to enter his bedroom. You're not good enough friends of Evelyn or George to enter their bedroom. Okay, all right, fine. Everybody's just accusing Mark and Dubois of going into people's bedrooms. He ain't, he ain't about that. He just wants to meet people. It's Maru. Who's Maru? I don't remember her in the board game. Oh, aren't you the one who just moved in? I'm Maru. I've been looking forward to meeting you. Oh, yeah. You know, with a small town like this, a new face can really alter the community dynamic. It's exciting. <laughs> How's it going, Marty? <laughs> if, you, if I don't marry, if I don't romance Penny, well, I... Oh, wait, I just went in the, uh, the trailer park. <laughs> well, I, I gotta know... I don't think I'm going to have nearly enough time playing this in order to romance anybody. I'll be lucky if I get to meet everybody. Where's the doggone forest? I want to forge some stuff and sell it. I've literally spent the whole day running around town doing nothing. Oh boy, a slide. Here we go. I've also spent like half my money on the Joja Cola. That was, that was probably not the best investment. But I'm taking this a little less seriously because I know it's just a one-off. Although people could put it back on the roulette. Oh, hey, dude. It's Har oh, it's Harvey. I perform regular checkups and medical procedures for all the residents of Pelican Town. It's rewarding work. Yeah, and you get you get the big buckaroos. It's Jody, it's a quiet little town, so it's very exciting when someone new moves in. Having a farmer around could really change things. How much have I played Stardew before this? Um, I played it once for like a half hour with Link. Stardew was one of those games where I'm like, it definitely seems like it's a, uh, it's great, but if I'm playing a farming simulator, I'm generally going to be playing Harvest Moon 64, or maybe Friends of Mineral Town. Oh hey, is this uh, Marnie's farm? It's locked. Only Leia's friends can enter uninvited. I'm kind of friends with Leia. Oh wait, I don't think I've met Leia actually. Oh no, is this? Yep, it's Haley. Oh, you're that new farmer boy, aren't you? Huh? Oh, I'm Haley. Yeah, I know about you, Haley. You're the Karen of the game, from what I understand. And I don't mean that in, like, the derogatory term. I mean that in terms of Harvest Moon characters. Yeah. Oh, take that! How about you aim upwards, Marky? Yeah. Uh, is this a hammer? That's a hoe. I don't even have a hammer. Doggone it. Where's all the stuff I can forage? What kind of a farming game would this be if I can't even forage stuff? Okay, let's go back to the map. Oh, wait. I'm on my farm right now? I did not even know. Wait, hey, why was Haley hanging out on my farm? Is she that thirsty already? I mean, maybe she came to get a drink of water at the watering hole. That's actually possible. 
Wait, is this my farm? Where is my field? Hey, DX, how's it going? When will I find the cute jelly guys? I have no idea what you're talking about. That's near Lazar. That doesn't help me at all, uh, Marty. I don't know this map at all. Oh. How did I get... Oh, wait, we gotta visit the wizard! Okay. We gotta find a way to get to the wizard's tower, if at all possible. He's the he's like the worst character in the in the board game. Was there a sequel or a remake of this game? It's not a particularly old game, so I don't think so. It's locked. You can hear someone inside though. Oh, I see. The wizard doesn't want to meet Mark Du Bois. Oh, I get it. That's fine. Mark don't need that kind of person in his life. <laughs> this is not the game you were thinking of. Were you thinking of Harvest Moon slash Story of Seasons then? That's the game where... That's my jam. Okay, let's go back to the farm. Okay, so this is actually... This is all part of my farm. Oh, ho. oh wait, we have a pickaxe, not a hammer. Oh, wow. My farm's kind of a dump. Wowie zowie. We got fiber. Hooray. It's a lot easier to get that in this game than it is in the board game. Okay, we gotta we gotta clear up some spots so we can start growing some parsnips. I do declare. It's also getting pretty late, but if the, if this is anything like Harvest Moon 64, there is literally like pretty much no penalty for going to bed late. Let's start. Oh, this is different from... Oh, wait. Okay, yeah, this is very different from Harvest Moon. I at least gotta start growing something. There we go. 10 p.m., time to go to bed. Let's go to sleep for the night. Yes, sir. Your progress has been saved. All right. Today, I want to go to the mine. So there's a path that goes up here and around. All right. We'll loop, loop past the carpenter's house. Ooh, you've got mail. Hello there, just got back from a fishing trip. You should come but down to the beach sometime. I've got someone for you. Willie. <gasps> Ooh, okay, change of plans. We gotta go to Willie first. Actually, no. Willie probably won't even be out until 9 a.m. Ooh. You know, there is something very calming about farming simulators. <laughs> You've got mail. Mail time, mail time, mail time, mail time. No, we should definitely go to the mine. Oh, hey, dude. It's, is this Zeus? It's Linus, a stranger. Hello. Don't mind me. I just live out here alone. I want to check out his tent. Oh, this is a lot... This is a, one of the few buildings in the game that seems smaller on the inside than it is on the outside. My tent follows basic uh, time and space. Okay, yeah, we want to go down here. Oh! Is this like a raccoon statue? Interesting. Oh, shoot. Is the weight of the mine blocked off? Oh no! 
Well, that's a shame. Well, hang on. Maybe we can loop around? No, probably not. Probably not. Shoot! Where's Lucy? I guess it's as good as mine. She dipped. It's locked, but it's open at 9 a.m. Story of my life. I still haven't met, uh, Lewis, the mayor. Maybe the list on the map where he is. Community center. Oh, that... He's probably at the community center. Ooh, the blacksmith. Oh, yeah, we should check out the blacksmith, too. Oh, Leia's cottage! We didn't see Leia! We should do that as well. Hey, girl! Have you met my mother? She's the town's carpenter. Alright, thus far, Maru is the only character who I really seem to have talked to a whole bunch. It's locked, but Jojo Mart opens in 10 minutes! Can I talk to you? Or do you not really exist? You only exist to actually sell me stuff. It's Morris. Welcome to Jojo Mart. How are you doing today? I don't believe we've met. I'm Morris, Jojo Customer Satisfaction Representative. When you decide you want to become a Jojo member, I'll be delighted to help you make your transition to a joyous experience. That smile seemed plastic. Besides, I, mo I moved out to the farm to get away from Joja. Hey, dude. Hey, blacksmith. It's Clint. Uh, hi, I'm Clint. <laughs> Sorry, I just had to sit in your seat. I'm a town blacksmith. If you ever need to upgrade your tools, I'm the guy. Boy, howdy. I definitely will eventually. Ooh, adding the munchables to the roulette. Okay. <laughs> will do, Marty. It's Gunther. Hello there, welcome to the Stardew Valley Archaeological Office. Uh, this is embarrassing. But your previous curator made off with the entire collection. We don't have any artifacts for display. But I'm hoping to remedy that soon. Hey, if you find any artifacts or minerals out there, would you let me know? Super promise. But there's nobody else here, so... Oh, hey, it's Penny! I'm tutoring Vincent and Jazz today. They're a handful, but it's nice to make a difference in someone's life. Yeah, Penny seems like a nice girl. Honestly, though, I'm not the biggest fan of the art style of this game. At least when it comes to the character portraits. <laughs> Go mine if I want. I can't! The guy was... there was it, The way was blocked. My mom won't let me have any more gummies today. Penny's the Maria of the game? Yes! Maria... To be, Maria and Ellie are tied for the top tier girl in Harvest Moon. So, how was your first night in the old cottage? It's Lewis! Your grandpa used to complain about the rickety old bed, but I think deep down, he actually loved that house. If the mine... Okay, if the mine is actually open... That's, that's the girl for me, then. But I, I don't know, Marty. Haley seems like a winner. I work part-time at Gus's Saloon. It pays the bills. You have blue hair, miss. It's a little strange. She seems like the potpourri of the game. Ah, my nephew Shane has been staying at my place for the past few months. Okay. To the beach. Oh, that's right. We gotta go to the beach. Willy Wonka had something for us. Oh, we went completely the wrong way. Boom. Bum, 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 bum. The music here is not as repetitive as it is in Harvest Moon, though, so that's pretty cool. Oh, he's smoking a pipe. If you want a good guy to smoke, you have him smoke the pipe. The tobacco. Ahoy there, son! Heard there was a newcomer in town! Good to finally meet ya! It's good to meet you too, Willy. <laughs> ah, I'm still trying to unwind from, from a month out on the salty seas. It was a big haul! I sold a lot of good fish. Finally saved enough to buy me a new rod. 
Here, I want you to have my old fishing rod. It's important to me that the art of fishing stays alive. And hey, maybe you'll buy something from the shop once in a while. That's the real reason. Yay! Fishing pole! You received a bamboo pole. Cool. Um, okay, let's swap that. I don't know why I put the decorative bowl in my hands anyways. Wait, no! Did I just... Oh, I see. I have to throw something out. Oh, I, if I... Okay, well, if I have to throw something out, I'll throw out the fiber. It doesn't seem like it's very good for much. Get rid of the coal? No! Coal is very important. Uh, the lights are dimming... Oh, wait, no. The lights are not dimming my house. Just one of the light bulbs blew out. Yeah, get rid of the fiber, clearly. There's good water here in the valley. All kinds of fish. Oh, yeah! My shop's back open now, so come by if you need supplies. I'll also buy anything you catch. If it smells, it sells! <laughs> That's what me old pappy used to say, anyway. I still haven't met everybody. Okay, we can buy trout soup. That seems bad. We got the bamboo pole. The training rod. It's a lot easier to use than other rods, but you can only catch basic fish. Oh, I want to buy the Fisher double bed. That's for Marky! Yeehaw! I should probably put the bowl back in my house. Inventory full. Not anymore. I want that muscle. Okay, let's go back to the farm, put some stuff away. And then we can try and go mine. I must not know where the mine is. Oh, we also need to meet Leia along the way. I don't think I've met her yet. Oh, I didn't, sorry, I didn't read this. Penny is the wholesome girl, Emily's the weird girl, Abigail is the hot topic girl, Leia is the artist, and Haley's the stuck-up one. Yeah, makes sense. For the guys, there's Shane, he's the red flag. Alex, he likes to work out. Elliot, the stuck-up writer. Sam, the band guy. And Sebastian, the best boy. He's the big nerd with the emo hair. Every I have heard people really, really like Sebastian. I guess you could say he's the best. That's a call forward, folks, for something that will eventually come to my channel. Hey, you look like Leia. Yeah, there you are. Oh, it's nice to meet you. You picked a good time to move here. The spring is lovely. You look identical to, uh, what's her name? Is it Robin? I went there, Marty. I went to the upper right, and there was a guy, there was a bunch of rocks in the way. And this guy was chiseling them very, very slowly. Yoo-hoo! Mark Du Boy, fellow farm boy. You're not good enough friends of Shane to enter his bedroom. And I won't be if I can. I don't think I've met any of the guys yet. And that's okay. The bachelorettes are what really matter anyways. Came into Jones. I can't date Robin. Oh man, but I but her bottomless fries are the best. Wow, this is a big farm. I don't like that tree just sitting there. Uh, do we got like a big toolbox somewhere that I can store my stuff in? Okay, oh, no, no, you know what? I know what I can do. I can plant the rest of me turnip seeds. Or turnip. Parsnip seeds. Chef Pierre! Open the menu, you can craft. Oh yeah, it's like Minecraft. 
A chest? We need a lot more wood for that. Okay. We can try that. Oh, another thing we can do. We can put the freaking thing back on the table. I just took it off as a joke. Also, we, uh, we should refill up our water sometime. Yo, Link! How's it going? I did not. I picked the good old generic farm for Market Du Bois. Oh, wait. Is that a cave right there? I got it. Why can't we move past the weeds? That seems kind of weird. Oh, this looks like a mine right here. Except there's nothing in there. Doggone it! I just want to go mining. Oh boy, a geode. You found a geode! The local blacksmith can break it open for you! Who knows what might be hidden inside. <laughs> boop -a -doop -boop -a -doop -boop -a -doop boop Where's the music? I don't mind birds chirping or anything, but... Alright, well, here we go. Mark the boys off to mine. Hee-haw! There doesn't seem to be, like, anything in this game that you can forage in the wild. Or maybe I'm just looking in Alderaan places. Yeah, so I went down and around. And then look. The way's blocked, and that guy's like, ah, you can't go through. Yeah. That bunny just disappeared. It's Demetrius? Why was I not told Demetrius was a character? Greetings! I'm Demetrius, local scientist and father. Thanks for introducing yourself. Oh, he's not a bachelor, that's why. I'm studying the local plants and animals for my home laboratory. Have you met my daughter, Maru? She's interested to me. Yeah, I know. Maru's the one girl who I keep running into. <laughs> well, I'm also used to Harvest Moon 64, where you only really have six screens you go to. Demetrius is the worst? Well, he looks... He seemed nice. Like, I can't talk to her, apparently. She's like, ew, I don't want to talk to you. Gross. Well, that's not very nice. Marky got a big glow up in this game. <laughs> Shoot, I wanted the mine. I guess we could fish. I know, I just passed the lake. That's Sebastian's dad, dad, therefore you don't like him. I thought Sebastian was supposed to be, like, the coolest guy. Oh, hey, so you're the new guy, huh? Cool. I'll see you around. I have a feeling Alex and I are going to be good buds. Oh, wow, lots of people here. What? What do you want? Go away. Okay, fine. Oh, it's Pam! Yes! Hey, kid, the name's Pam. <laughs> hey, Gus, give me another round! <laughs> yeah, alcoholic granny. <laughs> Why can't I talk to these people? Hi, please relax and enjoy yourself. <laughs> There's some scenes if you date Maru or Sebastian, that kind of shows he's not great. Oh. That's a shame. Where the heck is Sebastian, by the way? He's like the one character I, I, I have not met now. Also, my energy is low. I better drink the Joja soda pretty quickly. I gave him the Gus voice! <laughs> he's a basement dweller. Go back up towards the mine. Oh, he's a basement dweller, eh? Oh, hang on. Who are you? Oh, wait. Never mind. I know you. Chef Pierre! Why was there an exclamation point? Oh, help wanted. Looking for quartz. Cash payment on delivery. George. 75G on delivery. And it makes George happy. I'll accept. There's no deadline for this, right? Like, he'll always be happy? I don't know, folks. You guys... People have hyped up uh, Sebastian kind of a lot. Is he near the community center? Oh, carpenter shop. That's where we gotta go. The deadline is today. Oh, we'll probably find quartz, even though we can't go to the mine. <laughs> Look, if it was impossible to get quartz in five hours, they wouldn't have posted it today. Sorry, I have to keep checking the map because I suck at this game. Uh-oh, it's getting late. Oh, wait, hang on.
Okay. I'm not sure what I did wrong there. It must be like Big the Catfishing where you actually have to push a button to make Froggy get on the lure. I pressed the bu I pressed the tool button to catch. And it didn't do anything. It's locked. No, I'm just too late. I'll never meet Sebastian. Because we're about to run out of time. Oh no, I gotta head back to the farm. ASAP. Also, is there seriously nothing to forage in this game at all? Or am I just... Okay, hang on. Maybe... Okay, I haven't been up there. Maybe, maybe you gotta go far to the east. Maybe you gotta go towards the wizard's area in the woods. Because uh, Marky doesn't have a whole lot of cash left. Thankfully, I don't have to buy food or anything. Marky can just eat the fiber. But it sure would be nice. Man, my farm's kind of a dump. Dude, is there an auto save in this, or does it save every time you go to sleep? Mark a newcomer. Dash me. Emily single. Oh yeah, it saves when you sleep. Cool. We're going to sleep for the night, and sorry, but I think that's all the time we got for this one. Oh, it's raining. I didn't even check the weather. One time I didn't check the weather, it goes to rain. That's pretty cool.